Fukushima triad's efforts to revitalize its major cities near its transportation hubs got a huge financial boost today. The U.S. Housing and Urban Development awarded $1.6 million to the Piedmont Authority for Regional Transportation, or PART. The money will go to major cities and smaller towns and will be used to help the communities to combine housing, transportation, and land use to make them more sustainable. Project manager Mark Kirstner says getting this money is a watershed event. We certainly hope that at the end of the day this creates a more sustainable community for all of us, whether that means better transportation systems that reduce cost for transportation for individual families or creating the type of economic environment that continues to create jobs in this area. The money will also go to help make communities in the Piedmont develop economically and be environmentally friendly. From News 14 Carolina, this is your evening news now. Hello, you're watching News 14 Carolina, your local news channel, available 24 hours a day exclusively on Time Warner Cable. I'm Heather Waliga. This is the Piedmont's best source for up-to-the-minute weather news and sports around the clock. Now here's Tim Boyum to look at our top stories. The Piedmont Triad is gaining a big chunk of change to help create livable and sustainable communities. I'm Caroline Blair and I'll have the details. Planners in the Piedmont are gaining a chunk of change to help make the community more sustainable. The grant is one of 44 nationwide aimed at helping both rural and metropolitan communities improve their transportation, housing and economic development. News 14 Carolina's Caroline Blair has more details on the planning program. For the first time ever, the U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development is awarding millions of dollars to support more livable and sustainable communities. Finding ways so that, that we, can, we can have enough energy, use our own energy, but not deplete resources for fu the future generations. The same with natural resources, the same with economic well-being. The federal agency granted the Piedmont Authority for Regional Transportation $1.6 million to support a new initiative aimed at connecting housing with good jobs, quality schools, and transportation. This is the first time that we're going to take a comprehensive, integrated look at all factors that relate to our quality of life here in the triad and hopefully come up with some very usable tools that counties, cities, towns, communities, neighborhoods, and even families can use to, to create a more sustainable lifestyle. The planning stage will last two and a half years and will encourage investments in revitalization and redevelopment in major cities and smaller towns, focusing on deteriorating neighborhoods and abandoned manufacturing areas. We're looking at people who need transportation to jobs. We want to link transportation to housing. And although a number of different agencies are working together on this project, they say they won't get anywhere without the public's help. We would certainly want people to stay, uh, get engaged and stay engaged in any way that they can. And then uh, after that period of time, we believe that we're going to have some very good tools that um, counties and local governments can use to, to improve sustainability here in the triad. Reporting in the Piedmont, Caroline Blair, News 14, Carolina. The Sustainable Communities Regional Planning Grant Program will involve a number of organizations and governments in 12 Piedmont counties.